Welcome back to the Black Parade, Mission 9, Arcane Sanctum. Uh, so we're trying to get up, but got myself stuck on some cushions here, trying to get up to the top of the highest floor. Is this roof going to be hard to drop? Very fancy. Let's take a look there. Cool. Well, uh, let's... <sighs> Can I read this? Maybe that's got useful information. Who knows? Mage Hawthorne, I already have to deal with Adept Omwara's incompetence, but you have gone too far this time. Where did you find this creature? And more importantly, how could you possibly imagine it was a good idea to lure it in our sanctum? It took us six hours to trap this beast in the laboratory, and our good alchemist dragon is now locked out of his workplace. Now, granted, it is a most interesting specimen indeed, but it is much too dangerous. Imagine if it were to break free and wreak havoc on the grounds. Nay, better get rid of that thing before it slays us all, Yerodo. Can I jump and land on top? I guess I think I can. Okay. I'm thinking that door might be... That's the staircase. These guys are spreading carpets everywhere. It's great. Well, this might not be where I need to go, but... Ooh, the frame rates. <laughs> uh, I mean, it's good to you, but... Dropping frames like a madman. Okay, we're getting higher, right? We're part way up the tower already. There's the other tower. No, where's the other tower I was thinking was the higher one? That one. I mean, that is reasonably high. Definitely not the highest. I saw this guard with a battle axe there. Did we get a chance to see him again? There he is. He's strutting like he's going up and down the catwalk for the fashion parade, but. Alright, Archmage! Get this damn curse off me, please. Look, here's some fun. Trinkets for you m m magic peoples to work with. Well, if you've got a statue facing the wall, that's... That makes me nervous. Well, this isn't even a noisy floor. I mean, this is a really cool... This is an amazing floor. Look at this floor. This is really cool. And... Uh... You know, I have complained on many occasions about carpets slathered at random angles, but honestly, these mage guys are just... They're doing it just so flagrantly, they're doing it everywhere that it actually fits. Whereas, like, other people are just like, oh, we'll just have a carpet in the middle of the room and the carpet will be at a funny angle. But now here they're just like, we're just carpeting as much of the floor as we got carpet for at the moment. It, wor it works in this aesthetic when, I haven't, when it hasn't worked anywhere else I've seen it before. I'm not so sure about this carpeted archway though, it's a little weird. <laughs> but okay. I mean, they are putting carpets on all the walls everywhere. I guess that, you know, it's definitely channeling a uh, Middle Eastern kind of vibe. I mean, the uh, mages, I guess, are supposed to be recent areas and already had a bit of that vibe going for them. The thief in, in Stock Thief. Certificate of Ownership. It is hereby certified that two certain castles situated within the quarter of High Watch are now registered in accordance with the property registration decree of the year 6489 in the name of Yerodo Ibn Harud. Approved and sealed under my hand the seventh day of Sichitas of the year 81. Thomas Trilly, first clerk, High Watch Registry, under the approval of Master Brenda, Lord Mayor of High Watch. Okay. Well, this is the Archmage's quarters. That's a very pretty ceiling. Is that the Archmage? Wait a minute, what's going on here? Or I... Let's find out whatever information I can find out before I start poking my nose into things. Commander Fiend, you do my humble self great honor in addressing your request to me personally with 
balance respect with authority here. I sympathize entirely with your concern for the defense of our great city, one in which we are mere guests. But we have made this fortress our home, and we are incentivized to protect it with our lives. We retain a contingent of trained guards, many of whom remain from before our purchase. The bastion has been transformed into a sanctuary for magic. The bodies of our powerful forebears are interned here. Appeal to our legal foot indeed, and our ability to protect the castle ourselves. Having to bow and scrape to this commander fiend, the binds is intolerable. We are on solid legal footing. The Baron and his lackeys have no recourse to deny it. But I have no doubts that our rights would evaporate were we not to maintain decorum in dealing with his inner circle. It would not be so bad if his pretense of territorial defence were not such a paper-thin excuse to force us from Highwatch Castle. Since our arrival, this bastion has been transformed into a sanctuary for magic. The bodies of our powerful forebears are interned here. Does he imagine that on sight of Blackbrook Blackguards we would be so overcome with fear that we would scurry like mice from this fortress? We would conjure the eternal fire itself, the scourge of Highwatch, before we relinquished it. To Archmage Carino and the Majors of the Inner Circle. Something must be done about our brethren of past who formed this group known as the Falstaff Wizards. They operate in the shuddy quarter people call Murkville. I'm almost certain they practice dark arts there, in addition to using their magics for lucrative goals, which is, may I remind you, strictly forbidden by our doctrines. Such scandalous behaviour is a breach to the tenets of our noble brotherhood. Forget this harmless, loving stock traveller like Azran for a while, and please concentrate on a matter of importance. Gerodo. Harmless laughingstock troglodyte Azran. Um, I get the feeling Yerodo is not going to be quite so receptive to my pleas to help against the necromancers as I might as I might prefer. Hello. I thought this was going to be a long drop out the back of the... Uh... You know, the, the, the privy, what I'm trying to say. But no, it's not. I was going to jump down it if it was. I was going to say and jump down it. Uh, so, yeah, something something is going on here in the Archmage's Quarter, and I guess it's about time for us to figure out what. It rocks. An invader, An invader not only of our keep, but of my sanctum. Who are, Who are you? A talking statue, again. My identity is of no importance, but please, you have to hear me out. I have little, I have little time for the sycophants among my own people, let alone some common interloper. Do you know who I am? I'll have you removed immediately. And here I thought you, the wisest of mages, would listen. Was I wrong? Azaran. This name rings a bell. I'll bet it does. Do you know he's here, in the city, conducting the trickster knows what, and that innocent people are being used as his playthings? Be glad, Be glad your groveling does not yet offend me. Indeed, your fear of Azaran is amusing. If even the lowlifes of this sick city know his name, he has surely lost all capacity to do harm. He is not, I assure you. I was supposed to steal an item from him, but it was a trap, and now my life is being siphoned. I need your help in bringing him down. I've heard your kind hates necromancers. Steal an, steal an item? item? You, imagined you imagined my heart would soften for a petty thief? One whose greed has consigned him to a dismal fate? If Azaran were a threat of any significance, do you think he would waste his hours contriving traps for nameless scum like you? Do you really think I went through all this trouble to get these items as a prank? Look, this necromancer is highly dangerous, and I'm telling the truth. You compound, you compound your intrusion and sniveling with this foul desecration of these sacred icons? Enough! You want to, to die like a dog for your transgressions. No doubt, no doubt the sentence is long overdue. Lock the door! Search the area! We can't let the intruder get away! Right. Don't let the intruder get away then.
Figured that would not go well. Well, I guess my prediction that he was in on it is maybe not true after all. What have we got, objective-wise? Well, bad news. Talking to your roto god is nothing. Good news! We can steal valuables and knock people out now! We're still not allowed to kill anyone, but, uh... I can go take all that lovely, lovely loot. But damn, that's when Shiroto is a stubborn one and leaves you no choice. Steal Davidja's amulet. Oh, right, we better get it ourselves. You went through an ordeal to get these made relics and Shiroto threatens to kill you for it? Sack their castle for 2,500 loot. Okay, not only can, can we steal valuables, but uh, we really should. All right, so we're so the game is on now. We're, the guards are presumably all back from dinner. And, uh... Well, if I'm, if I'm not getting badly stuck on this door... There we go. Wow, that was much more fiddly than it should be. Although, do I want to do this yet? Alright, the guard guards are searching the area, yeah. There's a key on that guard that I wouldn't mind having. Oh, the statue's turned around. The statue has turned around. Is it going to act like a camera now? That would be... Cool. And also... Really uncool for me. Look there. Just the wind, I guess. Yeah, what did I press? I think I must have pressed B by mistake and nearly made a lot of noise. Okay. I don't know if that guy had any loot in his room. I kind of... I'm gonna check now. Is he carrying an accordion up and down the stairs? Oh, it's a shield. This guy's a shield wandering around. Okay. Well... Maybe we can see about... Dealing with... Oh. Oh, I've got the key, of course. Oh, yeah. Old Castle Master Key, that's what I'm talking about. Well, so much for that. I guess I need to steal this damned amulet after all. So now we have to run to the castle. Now the reason for having the maps of it makes sense. Kind of would have been nice to actually find the maps inside. To start off with a just a really rough sketch map showing... Hey, how come there's always a thief when we're on guard duty? I mean... We're obviously the best, so how come? Uh, well, this time the thief didn't steal anything. At least, not yet. And we know he's still in the vicinity. Couldn't have gone far. Just have to find him before he gets away, and we get our sorry hearts fired again. The last job we landed was so perfect. Such a shame the red stone got stolen, and the boss got arrested. We're gonna lose that one too if something gets stolen and he escapes, you idiot. Come on, stop talking and help me search. <clears throat> the City Tribune. Infamous crime lord DeWall arrested. DeWall, the well-known city warden, was arrested yesterday by the Baron's police with the help of the Order of the Hammer. The assault was personally led by Captain Pierce Hall, who told the Tribune, Today we celebrate a great victory. Thanks to our relentless efforts, we have triumphed over crime. To all of his men were the plague of the city, and rest assured that every criminal will suffer the same fate as long as I am in command. More on page 6. Gems of Sarnoth cut in small pieces and found on the black market. Lord Solus, owner of the fabulous gems, discovered three months ago that his precious gems were gone when he came back from a banquet organized by a vast collector, Lord Randall, in downtown. The case was so mysterious it was dropped two days after the theft. But now a respectable diamond cutter from Upper Dark Smoke claims he has clearly identified small diamond fragments as being... Without a shadow of doubt, the gems of Sarnoth cut in small pieces for the black market. More on page 9. I'm hearing footsteps on this uh, stairwell, and I don't know if they're coming up or down. I guess I could just rope. Did I drop down safely? No, it looks a bit high for that. I'm going to try the stairs. So this floor, it's also a really nice floor, but is is noisy. I 
I mean, the stairway goes a long way, so I guess I can observe where people are on it. He's going down a floor. I shall build shelters from the winds, feel the countless waters, see the vast earth, and burn the fires. Okay, we've been here before, but we did not really... I read that one, right? Yes, the creature in the basement. It's not a valuable painting, is it? No. This is a cool little uh, alcove here as well. Can't read that. This level is architecturally really cool. Gotta, gotta give them credit for this. It's... I think I think the mages are the least interesting of the human enemies, and actually one of the weakest. I mean, they might have changed their. Well, actually, let's do some science here. Hey, hey, man. Mysterious, Mysterious sounds. Feel the sting of my head. I'm trying to get him to back up. Away from the door, that's it. Right, now I can do the science. Yeah, okay, he's just still doing the exact same... Exact same aerial elemental, does a little wiggly hand wave. So that they take forever to cast their spells and are easily stunlocked. Um, yeah, the science was one you know, what I was wanting to test is, have they given them shorter attack animations so that they're not, don't have the same stomach ball quality. At least for some of them they said they've kept the stock ones. Alright, what was this? To Mage Olivia, residing at Highwatch Castle from Mage Techwar, may this missive reach you post haste. We did it. We found the way to the place under Earth where our brethren buried the Talisman of Fire all those decades ago. It took out Mage Ehi on many moons of symbiosis with the treacherous rivers of lava flowing under the city to find the location of the Talisman. And believe me when I write this, it is located inside a sunken city of yore, more ancient than anything found in this wretched part of the world. Now that we know where it is, the Inner Circle is thinking of mounting an expedition to retrieve it. This is very exciting news, brother. I sincerely hope Archmage Yorodo will allow you to join us on this quest. <clears throat> nice. Giving some justification for... Uh... Oh, I was going to go downstairs, but if he's about to go downstairs, I should not. Giving justification for... Uh... The thief gold, why the mage is there? Until my return to the Oh okay, no, he's just fly. chilling there. I don't know if he's gonna go downstairs or not. I shall build shelters from the winds, feel the countless waters, see the vast earth, and burn in eternal fires. I mean the burning can be easily arranged if you if you want. Well, I could avoid the stairs. I could either, I could take the passage again. I'm more inclined to try some. Oh, except... <sighs> I would be leaving my rib out behind this way. Concerned about my rope. I mean, I, yeah, I need it back. I only had three, and I've left one behind at the top already. I can't leave this one behind as well. Maybe I can run upstairs and get it or something. Let's just scout around for other stuff. Esteemed Dance Mage Carino, I humbly ask you and the Inner Circle to review my request for transfer at the Mage Keep. Working under Archmage Yorodo is, quite frankly, as exciting as stubbing one's toe. The man cares not for anything except tending to his own experiments along with Alchemist Dragon while we are left to our own devices. While some of my brethren certainly enjoy this amount of freedom, I would rather continue practicing the art of water magic under Greater Mage Ibarra's supervision at the Mage Keeper's Water Tower. Mage Vokil. I wonder if Vokil was the one responsible for the incident. 
That's a noisy ball. Okay. I had to jump, and because of the steps, the jump didn't jump. Oh well. Thrice now have I had visions of a threat looming over the city. Chaos, death, and hideous things coming from beneath the ground. It makes me uneasy. Could it be a cause for alarm? The common man, especially here in the city, fears the trickster, as he is entrenched in the folklore and the collective mind of its denizens. And yet no scholarly proof of half these tales have we. He is a force to be reckoned with, but he is a mere mortal, a demigod, and nothing more. I must meditate on this some more. If I am to bring this matter before my brothers, surely we will need to send a missive to all those entrusted with keeping the keys. Old alliances will be tested, and those fools will yet regret spreading their defences so thin. Should these events come to pass, that is. Well, see, that one is... I like less, because... It's a very keepery thing. It feels to me a... Not a very magey thing to be concerned with. So is this the staircase in question, right? Because the guy's coming down. He's coming down. I shall walk the path until my return to the eternal fire. I guess the good news is I can follow him up. Let's try going up now. See if I've got enough time to get up and down. Grab my rope and get back. A sound ripples through the air. It was nothing. Only just, only just. Wind blows. Fire burns. That was too close. Luckily, it's, there is some light here, but moving through it quickly, you make very little. Uh... Another good reason why thieves, thieves' sensor system, based on you know actual, is not just you're in light, you're visible. It's you're in light, you are visible, and so. Is this guy just going to stand by the fireplace the whole time? Uh, something there. Over there. Over there. Oh shit. Mm. I don't see anything now. Um. Their awareness takes a little while to build. Okay, I, let's have a look at maps. Do I have a map that fits this area? No, because I've only got a map of the first floor. So that doesn't help me at all. And the basement. A little bit of the basement anyway, so like this door to the labs. Clearly these doors do not connect. Hmm. What is over that way? Did I, clean, I did I rip up here? No. Have I been in this area? I don't think I have. Of course, because I skipped, I skipped this room, I guess, because I came through the... Okay, I've hit... About, then. I, I came up... Oh, right, I came up here. I went up there. I climbed up right up there. But I haven't been up there right now, right? That's where I was... I should get back up. I guess I missed a bit of that floor. Right, that's the vent I went in. Okay. <laughs> Which staircase is this? <coughs> 
Where are you going, sir? Is that you? Yes, it is me. Are you going down to look out? I think he's going to go downstairs again. I'm going to take this chance to run here. A ladder? Quiet. <sighs> you. Cease your noisy tap dances. Okay, is this somebody's. I hear you there! Yep. <sighs> Tried to leap at this and I hit the side of the. Bang wardrobe. Oh, well, there's no one up here and they can't get up here, it's just ladder access, so. Could have been worse. Hello, that's a strength potion. What do I need that for? Adeptical Dato, you are a fine adept, but I need to remind you that practicing magic outside of the castle walls is strictly forbidden. Doubly so when it's to amuse the populace by launching fire spells in the sky. I admit this is all very beautiful and adequate, but this is also quite dangerous for the Brotherhood. And do not think I did not recognize you. You have a lot to learn in the art of stealth, my boy. Major rehearse. Come on now, come on, come out here, I dare you. Silly little weird. Being an oriented pattern. Oh, I'm gonna have to wait for these guys to calm down before I go down, cause uh, it's fine. It's fine. Okay, it sounds like they're calm. Has this guy gone back downstairs yet, though? I think this is him now. Yeah, okay. I wish I had a proper map of this place, because... Okay, but... Come out and fight me! Oh, shit. <sighs> you just hear me again, I think you might have heard me again. Yeah, all right. Don't think you can hide for long. He's up there. He's not down here. That's that's the key thing. Oh, no, he is down here. Well, as soon as I find you, you're dead. You can't hide for long. If they don't find me, I don't have to flash bomb them. Nothing now. <coughs> when I find you, you'll regret it. Well, the other guy still seems to be searching, but he doesn't know where to look. That's that's the key thing. Oh god, I wish I had a map to this place because I don't know where I am and I don't know where I'm going. Like I want to scale this place, obviously, but I kind of want to know what connects where. I mean, I can drop down there, I suppose. Ooh. The other problem is a guy walking in that room. If I go through this door, I get spotted. I think he's coming through. Right. There's a guy upstairs. Okay, if he goes. That was my moment. Alright, this guy could be a nuisance. Where am I going? Where am I going? Well, there's nowhere on there except that other staircase. I don't want to go down that staircase. Have I been on the eastern side of this room? I don't know. No, I have not, right? Who's there? Who said that? There's way too much marble floor for me for my liking before but I think that's the way to go oh well <laughs> all right this here I have to complain I have to say you know of all the things I do like I don't like these arches I think these arches need uh, a couple more facets on them for the for the uh, angle they're going for I don't know there's, there's a full wedge arches rather than uh, using cylinders 
I don't mind those ones. Those ones are fine. It's just the angles on this one. Just ends up looking really chunky. Could have used six wedges instead of four. Six wedges would have used two more brushes, but no more cells. Yeah, there's so many people here. And it's bright where I'm going. It's not and loud, bright and loud. Two. Oh, noisy chairs too. Shit, 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 shit. Noisy landing, because I could misjudge the distance. I thought I would make it, and I didn't quite. God comes here in court. Major Theorem, one of the scrolls of transmutation is missing. I was about to move a whole shelf worth of scrolls when I noticed that one of, them, one of them was nowhere to be found. I reviewed the scrolls registry, but nobody took anything in ages. Could this be linked to that grunt that went missing about a week ago? You may not have heard of it, but apparently one of the mercenaries went to do his rounds, but failed to report to the captain afterwards. They scoured the authorized grounds looking for him, to no avail. I personally don't value their lives much, and I don't think these brutes can even read, but mayhaps this is linked somehow. If yes, how did he manage to intrude the Grand Library without anyone noticing? Major Laius. I'm getting uh, frame rate drops here as well. Can I fit in this? <sighs> Can. They've got a, an indoor tree as well. And there's an upper floor here and just... Oh, god dang it. I need to explore as well. They have lots of dark corners, though. And I will admit, as much as I don't really like the probable candles as a mechanic anywhere I've seen it, even beginning in Thieves 3, it's really handy in a situation like this. There is a disturbance. Even though I am allowed to uh, KO people now. Ooh, explosive barrel. Oh. Oh, I was trying to pick up the crate. There was loot behind it. I shall walk. But I dropped the loot first. Return return. The crate probably should have had block frog on it just for uh, safety, but never mind. No big deal. I was looking there anyway, I suppose. I need to go that way. Stop going that way, guys. I need fewer people that way. Noisy gravel about. Okay. <laughs> Noted. <laughs> yeah, there's also footsteps everywhere. This place is so... Uh, open. <clears throat> I shall walk the path until my return to the eternal fire. Okay. Oh wait, is there another one right there? Wind blows, fire burns. Okay. Shakes, water blows. This is the noisy floor and a <sighs> guy comes this way, so I need to be careful. Okay, that's not footsteps here, that's down below. This place is so open, footsteps just reverberate everywhere and it's very hard to tell. I mean, this place is so open and like, it really feels like a dishonored map, not a thief map. <laughs> Man, this stairwell is, this room in the stairwell is, oh God. I hate this mission, not because it's bad, but because it's so good. It's, it's envy. Make such good maps, people. <sighs> Make shitty maps so that I can feel better about mine. What vision disturbs me? All is, All is still. Okay, shit, shit, where am I going? 
Also, this place is so dang open, I am completely lost. <laughs> I have no idea where I am. But it doesn't feel... See... When, this, when a city is interwebby, it feels wrong. But a big castle like this being interwebby... You know what I mean? Like a big web of interwoven passages and... Ways to go and... Ways to rip down. It doesn't feel wrong. It feels... It feels... Uh... Oops. Oh, that's... That's what happened. Uh, that's my fault. Okay. The thing that happened the other mission. For some reason, I've got some keybinds here from uh, Dromed for tilting the camera. Which is not... So that's why it was all sideways in the last mission. It's not a bug in the, anything that happened in the mission. I just must have pressed X. Why do I have those... This is this is my thief installed for playing games. Why do I have drumhead bands in here? This makes no sense. Why do I have those band of drumhead? Maybe I was just experimenting and forgot to unexperiment. That also explains why it didn't undo itself. It was uh. It was uh. It's an intentional setting that you can use that you can you know have keybinds for. Oh, it's a battle axe guy. I was wondering why it's slow footsteps. I'm thinking maybe the using the stairs is actually a better idea than this, because I'm going to make noise when I mantle this, probably. <sighs> or rather, when I reposition on it, or step off it. How are they going to go clank now? There we go. Little clank. It also... If it didn't do that little clunk, it would make a big clunk when landing. Mage with big staff. And a key, and a key. Battle Axe Man is coming back. What vision disturbs me? I mean, I've got a master key, right? Deceived me. All is still. First sepulchre key. Okay, don't come this way, man. Oh, the other thing about this map? The spaces are a good size. The spaces give you room to dodge around people. You don't have to... Well... Okay, he's going to... He's stopping there. Where's... I'm getting stuck under the painting here trying to stand up. Is there any reason to be on these beams? I don't know, let's have a look. <sighs> I don't see anything on them. It's nice and dark. It's... That's good. Okay, so I could go west or north. I, shall walk the path until my return to the I think I want to go fire. west. <sighs> that was close. I wasn't sure I was going to be able to do that. Someone's coming up and will see me walk out the door. Blows, fire burns. Earth shakes. Water. What vision disturbed? Nothing. You saw nothing. You, you do not. Do not yeah. The earth will protect me. Oh, don't kill anyone. Whoops. I forgot. I forgot I wasn't allowed to kill anyone. Okay. I shall walk the path <sighs> so he saw me go out there. Yeah, and took fall damage that time. That's not good. No, someone else saw me. He wasn't him. He doesn't know his staff. Who was who saw me then? Oh, this guy came around the corner and saw me. I didn't even hear him. His blows, fire burns. His footsteps are... shakes. Water flows. Oh no, he didn't hear me. He patrols out there. Okay. Uh, 
Okay. I shall walk the path until my return to the eternal I mean, fire. His footsteps are all wrong though. Right? Well. <clears throat> okay, let's grab the loot. Go back in. So, I mean, I could maybe do something out there, but I guess I want to keep going on these interiors. Uh, I'm only two hit points down. I don't have any food, right? No. What a silly idea that anybody would go there. Who is there? Is someone there? Nothing here now. Shit. Sure. Hello? Show yourself. Wait, what? Where's this? What did not do not? <laughs> Ow! Ow! Well, let's do so well until I run into a. Oh wow, he. He mad. I was about to go, but someone else was just coming in this area. Okay, he doesn't know anything, but he would have seen me go up the stairs. The guy running away would have given me a good opportunity to uh, try and get up the stairs without being seen, but not with this guy being here. I'm just gonna stand there too. You get out of the way, yeah. Pull axe barbarian. Like he's on parade. Who's there? Who said that? Nobody said anything. All right. Oh, he did actually hear me, probably. Betwixt the boundaries of reality, there is this cold, desolate place only disturbed by dusky winds. What could be best described as a Cyclopean cathedral stood before me, floating above the everlasting darkness. The building was so colossal and so perfectly crafted it could have been one of the master builders' fabled works, but nowhere could I find a divine presence within the bleak stones. It was more like an embalmed corpse, preserved and pickled by the will of some unknown gods to eternally wander these hollow wastes. What I found the most disturbing was the landscape. There was an, only en an endless sea of sinister pillars as far as the eye could see, standing before a scorched sky. Then I saw it, a lonely fire upon one of the furthest pillars with a few huddled black creatures gathered together around it. I could not get any details of these ghoulish illusions, nor could I see what they were doing through the haze of absolute wrongness that surrounded them. They were so far away, but then it hit me. They were staring at me. I awoke as fast as I could. The very origins of this place are still a mystery to me. I could not find any precise mentions of it, just bits and pieces in several forbidden tomes. The ancient philosophers called this plane by numerous names, Inter Alia, the Architect's Nave, the Tomb of Empires, or more strangely, the house in which gods die. The last name I saw was the perfect way to reflect its hideous nature in a non-whimsical way, the Black Sanctuary. This is no place for the living. Hasdrubal de Flaufworth, only romancer extraordinaire. Obviously that's the next level, right? I don't know if he's still searching for me, but I know the... I know the uh, mage that lives down here is going to come back up at some point. I wonder if that trapdoor works or if it's just for show. Just for show, I guess. Let's just check again, just to be quite certain, so I can have not... Yeah. 
Okay. So if I can get down before the maze comes back. So I went right through this chair, huh? Kind of weird. Tiny corner behind it, I suppose, but feels weird to be crouching here. Okay. Right, he's just this little guard position there. I wonder if I can read anything on this desk. I didn't try. Just the mage coming back. I don't know. Read anything on this test. <sighs> oh, we're here. Who's there? Is there someone there? Nobody here. Please don't clink. I saw the metal below me there. I was worried for a second. Okay, let's, I need to go back and get that rope. But I don't remember this place. We were in the floor below. This floor. No. Okay, that's the mage going back up his staircase. Cool. Good to know. Alright, that's the way out. That's not readable. That's not lootable. Oh, what is this? A little nook here. Nice valuable candle. Hang on, let me test something. Quick save, quick load. Okay. Just checking an implementation detail of the candles there. I was sure it would be fine, but I wanted to check. Oh, so I could go that way. These are not lootable. I'm hearing Battle Axe Man up there, right? Ah, oh, so much, so much footstep noise everywhere. Where do I want to go? South? Northwest? Let's check out this way first. I don't like this readables scattered everywhere where most of them are not readable. It's really annoying. It's not like. Well, I was going to say, it's not like with loot. Oh, I'm getting frame rate drops as I go. Sometimes. Feels bad. Um, right, with loot, you can tell loot from afar whether it's lootable, right? And so look here, no, there's nothing there. Turn to the eternal fire. Not try to escape. Why not? What are you gonna do about it? You can uh to hide in the shadow, his wind <sighs> blow quickly. <sighs> okay, he thinks I'm still there, he has no idea where I went. Run from your fate. That's alright. It was very bad timing for me to go out there when he was just coming around the corner. He has to come into this room, of course. Well, there's nice places to hide and wait. How am I doing on healing potions? I've got two left, okay. That's fine. I need to use one soon, but... I'm only three hit points down the right thief now. Lurks in the darkness. Oh. I have okay. seen got someone else joining him in the search. Our unwelcome guest <laughs> and he's joining in too. Great. You, you still think this is someone here? There's nobody here. Give it up, guys. Give it up. Your fate is a hurricane. 
that cannot be the darkness will not protect you for long yes my fate is a hurricane that will uh, blow you away if you're not careful if i get impatient and decide to uh use my stick of hurricane here and then my forbearance is stopping me doing it right now you cannot escape the inevitable escape while you can we wish to be left alone Come well, guys, there's nothing here. You've searched thoroughly. If there wasn't intruder, they're gone now. I have eternity to seek you. I have eternity to uh, give up. I'm going back to work. You cannot escape. Okay, he's gonna go out there and he's gonna come right back, straight back in. Right? Oh no, he was on his way out when he got out of searching again because of the blue guy. Yeah, they do have some noisy teleport. Okay. So now I have some, may have some idea where we are. Right. We are right above here. That's the small castle I'm looking at. Okay, well that's this direction. Well, there's two directions to go. There's another way out of that room. No way, I've been here. That's the way I came in. Hang on, wasn't there another exit? There was this nook. It's not, wasn't there an exit? There was. I wanted to go up and get my rope anyway, so. Close for comfort. I don't know the way down, that's the problem. Hmm. <laughs> Why did that mage statue turn around? Still makes no sense to me, it wasn't anything. Upstairs. Where is he? Where is he? Hanging about in the library, being a nuisance. Okay. Okay. I need to go south. I want to get out that south and door. I haven't been in that room, I don't think. Right, I came in the door the other guy came in. I went up those stairs. This damn guard is standing. Well, marching. Towards me. Now this guy's coming in. As long as he stands. Okay. This is a moment. I have a moment. Just a moment. No, I don't. <coughs> These are the other footsteps I'm hearing. Okay. Okay, he's going upstairs now. Run. Wait, no, I have been here. Oh my god. Oh yeah, I want to go down these stairs. That'll take me back to where I just was. Okay, okay, okay. Right, here's where I was. Here's where I was 
decided I need to get back and recover my rope. Can I look in here? There's not, but there's a nice niche. Niche, nook. From when you can't decide whether you're going to say niche or nook, you kind of end up saying neek or nush, and neither of those are really words. What are these footsteps I'm hearing? <clears throat> We're definitely down on this floor now. <sighs> we just came down the stairs. I don't know if this room is clear or if the next room is clear. Could disruption bomb that light, but I feel like I don't need I shouldn't need to. I'm gonna, get, I'm gonna go for it. Okay. So there was only the one exit, but the second exit from this room, there weren't two different ones. <sighs> yeah, he's going out. He's going out the door, that's fine by me. I mean, I kind of need to go out there too, but... Relatively safe here. Yeah. I don't know how far he goes. I don't know how much. There isn't much room on that balcony. I'll take the risk anyway, I suppose. Nothing ventured. <sighs> I've got a quick escape now if I need it. Funny if you bumped into me and just like I walk backwards off there as if you push me. Oh, we're almost down at ground level now. Mystery presents itself. Okay, now he's going away. Sweet silence returns. It was a false vision. Getting into a nice nook, putting out the lights is a good feeling. I don't know how you would Supreme Ghost this, because you're not allowed to put out lights. I think the dreamers are trying it, so... I have to watch it. What is this guy doing? Is that you? You cannot hide from me. God, no. Dang clacking noises. Oh, he's coming and patrolling in here anyway to look out the window. Well, I guess some fortunate, fortunate that I was had my head stuck in the ceiling, right? Oh, somebody's coming in the door. Too many people, guys. Like, how am I supposed to move when there's so many people around? He's looking out that window. He's walking around. Okay, if they both go out that door, maybe that's a good thing. Don't step out into the light. Okay. A little more freedom of movement here. Hello, is this... What is up there? Have I been up there? I don't think I've been up there. I just want to get up there. I guess there must be a stairway. <sighs> Good luck. Hello, another air vent. What's this room? Was another level? Oh, we can get on the top. I'm out to the roof. 
<sighs> it's a nice sky. I wonder where that's from. Although the sun is pretty unconvincing. I think it could have been done better. Oh well. But look at that look at that skybox all around. Let's just get a <sighs> let's just get a view here. That skybox of the city all around, buildings on all the hills and stuff, that is really cool as a backdrop. Beats for, easily beats any of the stock thief skyboxes. Even though, regardless of the fact, it is much higher resolution than any of the stock ones. And we got, uh, is that part of the same skybox? Or is that silhouetted in front of it? I think it's just part of the same skybox. Yeah, if you don't look too closely and see the smoke isn't animating. Nice, no, that is an excellent skybox though. Very cool, very cool. Is that the tower I was in? Oh yeah, because he had the... These four, um... I guess I can point with the sword, right? Point with the tip of the sword. These four pieces, one of these was where the statue was and I looked in all the others, so that was the main guy's tower. This here is the other tower I was looking at. Which I haven't been up. I haven't been up that tower either. Can I see any way up onto that one? Uh, there's a window there. So, yes, it's possible. Oh, there's a flat bit on the top of the roof. And maybe you can just walk across the top of the roof. That would be cool. First, some loot and a gas arrow. That could come in very handy in a pinch. I'm very glad to see that. What is that? Did somebody see me? The guard thought he saw me. Where was he? Okay, hang on. Go back, come up in a minute. Come back up here in a minute, but I don't know for sure. I can't remember if I finished looting this floor or not. Right, yes, it did. Oh no, I want to check out the save event. Let's check out the save event and just see where it goes. <sighs> okay. Would you know it? The event goes exactly where I was looking at. Careful, careful, like him. Evan goes exactly where I was looking at, thinking, oh, we'll jump down onto that gargoyle. And run across the, uh... What do you call it? There's, there's a word for this. I don't know what it is. Ooh, it's close. Yeah, there's a way up here. We'll collect the towers. What are these spiky bits? Yeah. I can't go properly. Little spiky bits. I guess they're uh, meant to like nerds or something. I don't know. We're just meant to look. Obviously, it's in case the sky falls. It's to kill the sky before it can uh, do any real damage. Obviously. Okay, so I want to go across there to that window. I guess next. We're going away from the really tall tower that I need to go, but you know, one problem at a time. Okay, so no one on this level either. Yeah, size-wise, in terms of the size of spaces that you're in and size and connectivity, this level is absolutely perfect. Um. Hello? Is someone there? I think you saw me. Yep. One little noise. Well, I can get out. I can get away easily. Go run up the ladder. If he doesn't give up. Here now. Okay, he gave up. All right. You know what? I just looked. I just saw the time, so I think I'm gonna end the episode here. As I predicted. We didn't go and confront any beast in any basement this episode. See, I told you so. Maybe we will next time. Uh, we've got to find this... Amulet of Dubidge. And I have absolutely no idea where to look, so we're going to have to keep going this enormous castle from top to bottom, left to right, north to south, and inside out. And maybe we will 
finally find something. So, uh, see you next episode for that.